marijuana drug test. Oh! Guys, D just stole my keys and took off on my moped. What is going on guys? Welcome back to another brand new vlog. I'm feeling so hyped to be making a vlog today. So excited, so keen. I hope you're all doing amazing. I sure am today. Today's just awesome. I feel so clear-headed, clear-minded with my Australia tour coming up. I'm just so hyped to be able to, to be able to share everything I do in my life, like to a camera, which is, I, I mean, I kind of feel like you guys are behind the camera. You guys are the ones watching. You guys are the ones like looking into a screen, listening and watching everything that I'm doing right now. I'm just so keen, you know, with my Australia tour coming up to share all the memories and everything I get up to in my life with you guys. I just, I just feel so good. And uh, speaking of feeling good, this was my last video that I released. I released it probably like two days ago by the time you're watching this. Please watch this. And I basically explained all the drama. I mean, I, I mean kind of everything going on. I kind of just explained the truth behind everything and the positivity and the, you know, like just the great feedback I'm getting and you know all like the support is just amazing in the comment section trust me guys i read all of your comments and i mean there are a couple of hate comments here at wait what piss in a cup and prove it then we'll believe it do you mean like a a a, 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 a drug test Oh crap. I'm joking, I probably can't show you that. I, I, it's the it's the massive lump that I have on my leg from the crash that I had on my moped the other day. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I thought it would be a smart idea to bring my moped into the skate park and I crashed and I got a huge lump on uh, on my leg and I told you that like, I, I mean in my next vlog there's gonna be a huge lump there and I'll show you it and there is a pretty big lump. Uh, I just needed a cup of water. I was feeling a little bit dehydrated this morning. What did you think I was gonna do? I have got a massive lump on my leg, and that's kind of like half the reason I haven't, like, I haven't really made like a proper scooter riding, like, scooter riding video uh, the past few days is because I've literally like been bedridden, like I've not been able to really move around. And only just yesterday, like, kind of halfway through the day, I've just become like a lot more mobile. I can actually bend my leg. I can straighten it out almost as far, but like every time I move it too much, I get like a dead leg sensation, like it just goes numb and it just pretty much goes completely out of order. And I was thinking, okay, look, I'll go to the doctor, but then I was thinking like, I can still walk, I can still jump, is it really worth going to the doctor? Instead, I'll just go to the chemist and maybe ask them if they know if there's any like cream that I can, you know, rub on my leg to, to uh, help soothe the pain, or maybe if I should just take Panadol, maybe ask them if they know anything about my leg. But uh, after seeing that comment, while I'm at the chemist, Chest, this is Hi, uh, I was just wondering if you have like a uh, like a marijuana drug test kit thingy. Yeah, we do. Oh, you do? Okay, thank you so much. Thanks, bye. Bye. I'm gonna get drug tested just to uh, just to prove everyone that doubts me. D it's funny because my my last name's Doubt. Alright, I'm in the chemist right now. I can't video in this store or take photos. Oh, I can't film in here. No. Marijuana drug test in here. Uh, I don't know you. Thanks. Thank you. Someone's drug test came back positive. Not mine. I haven't. I haven't taken mine yet. Okay. Just got the drug test. It is a. It's a urine. It's a urine test uh, for for marijuana. I've never taken a drug drug test before, so I don't know. I don't know how this is supposed to work, but. Okay, this is the one that shows furthest back in your history of drug use. This shows up to 95 days before taking the test. That's over three months ago, and trust me, if I smoked weed, I definitely would. Like, anyone that smokes weed would have smoked in the past, oh, like, past three months. So, this will show up to three months. Three months, whether uh, I was positive or negative uh, in taking marijuana in the past. Like, that, like that, 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 that is a long time. This is the official proof right here. The legitimate drug test. There's gonna be scootering in this vlog, trust me, but for now, we're taking this drug test. Alright, so this is what it looks like, and uh... For anyone that doubted me, for anyone that doubted me this whole time for all the negativity throughout this drama, this is about to confirm the truth within minutes. I, I gotta go to the bathroom to get this done, so uh... Got all my, got all my stuff, I'll be back in a sec. Okay, so, um, so the, uh, so the test only needed three drops. I don't know if that's gonna focus up, but I've got the three drops in the syringe, and, uh, 
Yeah, the remainder can just uh, sit right there. That's kind of disgusting. That can actually sit a little bit further away. Okay, there's one, two. Okay, there we go. It's in. Uh, and it says, wait for the red lines to appear. The results should read at five minutes. Okay, well, I'll let that uh, do its thing. It's doing something. I don't know. I'm just going to leave that to the side. So I've got five minutes to uh, to show you a couple of things. So it is 2.36 p.m. So at uh, 2.41. See, I know basic math. I dropped out of school, but I know my basic math. 2.41 is uh, when the results should be made. So first of all, I just wanted to show you uh, a couple of packages that I got. And yes, there'll be a bunch of scootering later in today's vlog. I'm pretty sure. But uh, for now, we're doing this drug test. But uh, while I wait for the results, I want to show you a little package that rocked up from uh, from the homie Wesma, the founder of Ripico. Um, I've already actually opened it. I thought it was like a returned uh, like piece of merchandise from my website or something. I didn't actually know it was from Ripper, so I already opened it up, but I'm going to show you what I got right now. So we got one of the new Ripico 5 panels. These are super sick. Uh, it's You've got like all like the Ripper text in the inside, which is dope. you got the green bottom. It's black with the uh, with the white, very high quality embroidered Ripico uh, R with the obviously the text, and uh, you get the cardboard in there, obviously to keep it nice and uh, in shape, and it's a perfect fit. It's one size fits all. Yep, it's got the... Uh, it's got like the metal thingy here where you can like tighten it, loosen it, uh, and you've also got the uh, the nice little Ripico patch in there as well. So that's awesome, that's dope. I got a Ripico hat, I've actually been waiting on one of these for a while. And uh, he also sent me some grip tape, so I'm going to get right into this. I think we got a camo, we got a camo sheet. Out of all Ripico grip, this one has to be my favourite, the camo Ripico grip. This was actually the first ever piece of Ripico grip that I ever received from Wesma. And I think what I'm going to do is make like a outset select and Ripico grip tape collab because I have eight sheets of outset grip tape, a sheet of, uh, of Ripico grip tape. So I'm going to make like a really, really, really cool outset select X Ripico uh, grip tape collab. I don't know if I'm going to do it on the deck I've got right now or wait for a new deck or something, but I'm probably also going to bring a little bit of outset grip tape on my Australia tour too. Still got three minutes. Speaking of my Australia tour, um, if you go onto my website, it's the first link in the description below, www.jackdout.com, go cop some hot merch. Uh, it'll say on the homepage, no orders will be sent out, shipped out until Monday, the 10th of October. I'm pretty sure it's a yeah just check the website for the final date but while I'm away because I run the website all on my own for now it won't be like that forever eventually I'll have like maybe like a warehouse helping me out or I don't know but for now it's all me and while I'm absent on my Australia tour I will not be here at home packing merch so you can still make plenty of orders I was gonna shut down the website while I was away but I thought you guys can still make orders but keep in mind that the orders will not be shipped out until the 10th of October so you might be better off waiting or you can still order now and yours will be shipped off straight away um so jump in line get online uh, order some merch, but it won't be sent off till the 10th of October. And speaking of my Oz 2 up, the first meet and greet is on the 25th of this month, which is on next Monday, I'm pretty sure, at the Rabina Scooter Hut store in the Gold Coast. My next meet and greet will be... Let me get up the poster, because I forget. After the Gold Coast, I'm going to Perth, and my Perth meet and greet is going to be on the 29th at 2pm. All of them are at 2pm. Then uh, my next stop is Adelaide. A lot of you guys were confused. You Adelaide, you Adelaideans. Well, the Scooter Hut, the Adelaide Scooter Hut store will be open by the time I'm there. And that'll be on the 1st of October at 2 p.m. Then my uh, last but not least meet and greet is going to be in Melbourne on the 5th of October at 2 p.m. at obviously the Scooter Hut store. And uh, for Sydney, I might end up doing one at Scooter Hut, but I was thinking because I'm from Sydney, I could probably, you know, do something maybe cool at a skate park or, you know, organize some sort of jam session maybe with Wes Mackay and everyone. I'm not 100% sure, but, um... It's been four minutes, and we got the results right here, guys. Look, through all this drama, honestly, with the whole, like, thingy, I just want to confirm, I never said the photo was photoshopped. I said it was fake, and I cleared up in my last video. When I meant fake, I meant it betrayed the wrong image. It looked like I was smoking when I wasn't. One, the joints were not lit. Two, a lot of you guys were like, well, where'd you get the joints from? They were Benny Gaylards, I'm pretty sure. A lot of my friends smoke, and that, look, that's their own choice, but... Um, so if I smoked as well, I would just admit it to you guys, like a lot of my friends do, it's like, okay, so if I did, I'd just admit it as well, but I don't, and, uh, whether you want to believe me or not, this, uh, this piece of plastic right here has the results, so let me check. Okay, if I'm negative, it should show two lines, one at the top, one at the bottom, or at least one where the, uh, where the letter C is, and, uh, positive means there's only one line, and then, uh, invalid means it's just, like, one line on the bottom, so... That is what negative looks like. This will prove if I've had any marijuana in my in my system in the past three months. After this, I'm gonna go start riding my scooter, forget about this drama, do what I do best, which is just freaking riding my scooter. This is so stupid, but this is gonna put an end to it. This is gonna crush it all. Here are the results. Freaking focus, this is completely ruining all the suspense. Two lines! Wait, hang on. Two lines! 
There we go, two lines, that is the proof. There we freaking go. No weed has been in my system in the past three months. All of, I've, I've freaking told you, two lines. Negatory, ladies and gentlemen, cheers to that. Bruh. <laughs> Day number two of the vlog, I just woke up, I'm tired, I'm down at my garage right now. That's the button. We're good, it's opening. What do you guys think of this new, where's the light, where's the light, there's the light. What do you guys think of this new kind of approach I'm taking with my vlogs? Uh, after I put the camera down yesterday, I didn't do anything exciting, so I didn't keep filming. I thought, you know what, I'll continue tomorrow. I'm trying to kind of, trying to make these vlogs as entertaining as possible, rather than just trying to film anything for a daily vlog, you know what I mean, if that makes sense. So, it's day number two. I just woke up, oh, I'm tired, um, time right now, man, it's 10.26, I'm supposed to be at Waterloo by 10.30, I feel really, 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 really bad for Kai and, uh, Dunkeasy for being like, wait, what? Dunkeasy? Now, yesterday was, like, a little bit of a joke, I mean, it was, it, it, like, it was a real drug test. After I put my camera down yesterday, I actually went to my local park for a quick chill ride to get some Instagram content, uh, which is when this happened, that, that was a big shame. That pretty much stopped me from getting instant content. Um, and Dunkeasy was there and he came up to me and he confronted me with his camera and I just saw he uploaded the video this morning of me apologizing. Now, if it never got broadcasted across the whole skid range industry, then me and Dunk, like knowing us, we probably would have ridden like a week later anyway. Like, you know, we have like, you know, all, like all of us have our differences every time, but you know, we sort them out because we're friends. Um, obviously this was like a little bit worse, but it wasn't that bad, but because it like got broadcasted across the whole internet, it just got put into everyone's heads. Oh, it's Dunkeasy and Jack have beef, but... It was never that bad, man, and we sorted it out, like, uh, like I knew the next time I saw him, you know, we'd probably f figure things out. Uh, for all the people that are saying it's fake beef, it's definitely not. I got on my homies back and we're all riding today, so I'm actually about to jump on my moped, um, and I'm going to meet up with Kai and Dunkeasy and whoever else decides to come today at our Waterloo Skate Park. We're gonna ride there, get some warm-up clips, I'm in a bit of a rush, so I'm gonna switch up with the GoPro on my helmet cam. I'm honestly just so keen to freaking get to the skate park and just ride with the homies. Fingers are crossed that I go over the Harbour Bridge, because I really, really, really want to go over the Harbour Bridge. I might go under it, I'm just gonna follow Google Maps wherever that takes me, uh, and I should get to, uh, Waterloo. So GoPro mode, and now uh, we're gonna get on the road to Lou and just go meet up with all the homies. It was a long trip, but hey, we made it. We made it. Skate park is just up the road. I haven't been to Lou in weeks, and I haven't seen Kai for like months. Yeah, months. Yes, I forgot you were coming. Freaking Jack, dude. Wait, who's that? Bad time. Do I recognize you? No, I'm joking. What's good, dude? What's good? Long time I see you. Is this happening? Is this Lou? Oh, oh, of course. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. I'm no. Oh no, okay, yeah, no, just, yeah, okay, yeah. Guys, first of all, I forgot that Oliver White was coming. He's from Fort Macquarie. He, like, the last time I saw him, he was in my vlog here. And look at this colorway. Like, look at that. So fruitful and just saturated. Hell yeah. Anyway, um, well, we were supposed to warm up here. Well, like, they've all warmed up, but I was so late because I went back and forth over the Harbour Bridge, like, three times because I got lost. And, uh, we're gonna get out of here right now. I think we're gonna grab some food at Macca's, and then we're gonna go to some spots. That was me on the way here. Anyway, they've all warmed up. I was super late, so I didn't have time to warm up here. We're gonna go get food from Macca's, and then we're gonna go to the first spot. I'm think- I think I'm in charge of, like, the spots today. I'm taking them to this sick curved ledge spot, which is, like, around the corner. Not 100% sure on how to get there, but I told them I know exactly how to get there. We made it. We're all friends again. Get out of here, Ollie. Back Look at there. this. Just like the t this is sh this should be a thumbnail right here. If you didn't know, I have a YouTube channel. Almost at 50k. Same here. Get him to 50k, get him to Same. 30k. Get me 300 followers. Get him to like 50k, guys. I will be. 50K, like, we're all doing please. the same thing out here making vlogs, so why not, you know, me. help out all the homies? Come on. Link will be in the description. Damn. <laughs> Damn. I still can't do the no hander thing. We're going through the drive through on our scooters. Stop, please get a six No, you need to leave the drive through. We can't serve you if you're on your scooter. Oh. Uh, dude, I'm trying to order my. What? You need to leave the drive through. Oh, okay. Alright, see ya. Alright guys, this is the playground. I came here ages ago on a vlog and there's this massive slippery dip. 
Look how big that thing is. And there are these ledges in here. I'm praying that these aren't capped because this is a pretty new playground. Usually when new spots get built, oh no, they're not capped. We're all good. All right, guys, the essential warm up for this spot is to trek it all the way up these stairs to the top of the slide. Go down the slide and then we're ready to ride. That all rhymed. I'm gonna be a rapper, y'all. I'm just having fun today, man. I'm just mucking around, not taking anything too seriously. That's what it's all about. Riding and having fun with your homies. We had some differences, but it's all sorted. And I'm stoked to just be having fun with my friends again, honestly. Oh, this is hard to climb up. This is our progress so far, guys. Damn, hopefully our bags don't get stolen because they're just down there. We made it, guys. We're at the top. Look how high up we are. I can't believe they built this thing for kids. God damn. You can see every... Right. This is prime location for looking for new spots. Watch this. Look at those many pads over there. Damn, you got more right there. That's sick. We just found a new spot. Let's go. You just go. go. You go first. No, you go first. I feel like that's a bit. Okay, I'll go first. All right, we're going in, guys. Oh! Oh, oh my! Oh! <laughs> you get so much speed. Oh. Ah. Oh you just get. <laughs> Lumped out the end. All right, all the homies are here. Everyone's rocked up to the spot. I've put the GoPro on. I haven't got GoPro footage in like a while, like actually riding. So I'm going to get a quick session in. POV footage on the ledge and then film a couple of the other dudes. Maybe they can get me some clips as well. But uh, for now, GoPro mode on the ledge. Oh my God, guys. It's been a while since I've worn the GoPro while riding. I'm going to try to get a line around this whole entire park. Everything is so waxed up. You can go over everything, hit the ledges, up the banks over the rocks oh my god even the ground is waxed guys oh my god dude the ground is slippery it's like they've just gone overboard with the wax and even decided to wax the ground all right we'll just bar on to add to it rotor out chat deep and then there's this other ledge it's not really waxed up so it's just like a manual pad manual heel right, we're gonna go nose bonk over this hop over the bike Oh no, oh no. Hey, I'll right, back you up there, I'll back you up. D kind of interfered the line, but it's still going. Truck driver, and then we'll go 50. Bar rewind, I've never done that. Whoo, new one. You actually want to try it? Guys, D's going to try go down the slide and then come out here and then land on his scooter and roll away. I didn't go from the top. I reckon top. if you go all the way, right, you reckon we should try dunk easy cam? D's gonna go down the whole slide, trying to have enough speed to land. I'm gonna be holding your scooter, and he's gonna try landing it. All right, dunk easy cam. It's been a while, but it's about to happen, guys. I'm coming up, bros. All right, we're gonna try and climb up this slide, because it's way too trick going up the other way. So come down. No, don't. Oh, I feel like Spider-Man. Finally made it. Right, you, After down. all these years, I finally made it. Oh! You ready, do it? Yes, go, 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 go. Three, two, one. Go. <laughs> no. Jack, I'm going backwards. I'm just going backwards. Oh, oh shit. What's up, guys? <laughs> All right, well, the dunk easy cam wasn't as successful as I thought. He was supposed to land on the scooter. He kind of did, but instead he just decided to get on backwards. Dunk just does whatever he wants, guys. It's, it's the dunk easy cam. Let me know if you want some more dunk easy cam in the comment section below. Oh, D, get some clips on this ledge. Oh! <laughs> oh. He's just kicking back, guys. He's just chill.
right guys, that's all I got in me for this ledge. We might be hitting one more spot pretty soon. I'm pretty sure like after this we're gonna go somewhere. But there's something I gotta show you first. My Ripico SIG grip is now, at, well it's not technically available as I speak now, but Wesma just received it, he gave me a call earlier. I need to show you what it looks like. Because I all, I mean I haven't drunk orange juice in a while, but it's like my favorite drink. I always drink it at the start of most vlogs. Then like he's got my signature on the juice, kind of like at Starbucks how they do that. And now that Starbucks is in like Sydney, and like all over Sydney, it's kind of like, it works. That's the massive slide, we just left the park. I just filmed Oliver a clip for his full part. Kai's also filming a full part too, so maybe I need to get on that full part game. If you guys wanna see another edit from me, let me know in the comment section below, maybe from uh, maybe for Outset or Ripper or something, I don't know. Maybe I could whip something small up. Although I did get some Insta clips today, so you know where to find all those at Jacked Out on the gram. I got some, got some pretty chill Instas, but hey, it's something. Are you getting food? Riding in the straw gone wrong, chased out cops come 2017. In the hood. Go cut my SIG grip tape. OJ for life. You know my SIG grip has OJ on it. Ripico SIG grip has my OJ on it. Yeah? Yeah. I think we just got a new buyer for my grip. Only cause I rode in here man, I'm a clean rider, you know? Ah, the good old days are back. Guys, D just stole my keys and took off on my moped. Good ride. It's been like Dude. a solid two months or something Dude, since honestly, we've ridden. honestly, first time. It doesn't even feel like we haven't rode that long. But hey, because we ride at home. Anyway, yeah, everything's yeah. cool between me and Kai. Everything's good between me and Dunk. There was even some Dunk Easy Cam. Like, Dunk, even a bit of Dunk Last dunk words, dunk last cam. words about it all. Last words, um... It's, um... It was like we were never arguing, you know? It, it was mainly, um, broadcasted a lot because a few people found out then we had to broadcast it, but it was just pity, guys. We would have sorted it out anyway, you know what I mean? I'm jumping on my moped right now, the day's over. Let me know what you thought of, like, the new approach that I took to the vlog, like, filming it over two days. The tour starts the day, technically the day after this video is uploaded, so get hyped on that. We've got some crazy videos coming. Heaps of pros are going to be in my vlogs and all that, so heaps of new spots, heaps of new pros, heaps of new people in my vlogs. I'm so hyped. Hope you enjoyed today. I've actually got to go for a follow-up interview right now for that newspaper article. I'm having, like, a, like, a, pretty much, like, a, yeah, like a follow-up interview. Uh, remember that newspaper article I had an interview for a couple of weeks back? Well, I've got like a follow-up um, interview this afternoon, and that's in like half an hour, so I gotta go drive there on my moped. The moped's like finally coming in handy. It's so sick. So uh, let me know what you thought of this vlog. If you liked it, subscribe. Drop a like, turn on post notifications. The shout-out goes to this guy today. If you want to get a shout-out, hashtag notification squad in the comment section below, and I will see you all tomorrow. Let me know what you thought of this vlog. I'm really keen to hear what you thought about, uh, you know, the whole kind of two-day thing. I might do that a little bit on my Australia tour, but hopefully daily vlogs on my Oz tour, but I guess we'll have to find out. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Peace.